Welcome back to My St. Louis Live. Since becoming a mom, and now 16 weeks today into being a mother of two, whenever doubt on something, really anything in my life creeps in, I just remind myself that, hey, I'm a mom. I can handle this. I love that feeling of empowerment, and I know so many of you moms do too. But even though I'm in my postpartum era for the second time, I still find myself Googling, is this normal? Three months postpartum? What can I expect the first year after having a baby? Well, instead of going to Dr. Google, how about going to an actual doctor? Dr. Kathleen Jager, a BJC medical group OBGYN, and one of our favorite My Mom Club experts. Dr. Jager, it's good to see you. Happy to be back. Thrilled to have you, especially right now, because there's such an emphasis on what to expect when you're expecting. Mm -hmm. But once you have the baby, I feel like we don't have as much information. So first off, right off the bat, how long does the postpartum period of a woman's life last? So the postpartum period is more of an ongoing process than one particular point in time. And the resources and support that each woman needs are different. Mm -hmm. I will say the hormonal changes of pregnancy take several months to go back to normal. But a lot of the physical changes of pregnancy are back to pre-pregnancy state by around six to eight weeks, which is often why that visit is about that time frame. Your uterus should be pre-pregnancy size, lacerations and incisions should be pretty well healed. So six to eight weeks, a lot of those physical changes are back to normal. I'm glad you did bring up the hormones though, mm -hmm. um, because that's something just in the last few weeks, my husband and I have talked about a lot. So after that six week follow up, mentally, maybe we are still changing. What should we be thinking about three months after having a ba baby. Absolutely. The hormonal changes are still full swing at three months postpartum. Um, so a lot of women are still adjusting to that on top of taking care of a newborn, breastfeeding, all the things. Mm -hmm. That fourth trimester presents some unique challenges, breastfeeding challenges, lack of sleep and fatigue you've never felt before, having a new life that's totally dependent on you, maybe navigating intercourse for the first time, urinary incontinence, so lots of things that women are grappling with at three months. Two kind of unique things at three months, mm -hmm. postpartum hair loss mm -hmm. can be pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. It is normal and common and your hair will come back, but it can be alarming. Um, and a lot of women at three months are going back to work. So the physical and emotional challenges of that are unique to that time point too. I have definitely felt that yeah. thing you just went through. Yeah. Let's talk about a little longer. Six months, you're mm -hmm. in the groove and then a year. What are some of the changes we should still be expecting at those milestones? Absolutely. Different for every mother baby. At six months, a lot of moms are hitting their stride like you just said. Breastfeeding's well established, or baby's on a good formula routine. Maybe they've worked out a time or two, maybe even gone on a date with their husband. <laughs> Starting to feel a little bit more like themselves mm -hmm. um, by a year. After you plan that first birthday party, really more congratulatory for mom and dad. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of moms are thinking about future pregnancy planning and how big they want their family to be in the next pregnancy mm -hmm. um, and thinking about kind of that transition as well. And as we wrap this up, what about partners and other loved ones? What would you tell them the best way to support a new mom would yep. be? Every mother baby dyad's different, so follow their lead, but there are some things that are constant, good warm dinners, laundry, cleaning the house, emotional support, you're never gonna go wrong with those. Good advice. And I love when she comes in because she always has the biggest smile on her face because she's bringing life into the world like every single day. Every day. Good to see you. You too. We do a mom club segment every week here on My St. Louis Live, so please send me any topics you'd like us to discuss at laura.hedeker at firstalert4.com. Damon. Thanks, Laura. Well, our